need to get you need to get grooves. You can't even barely look. It's okay, there's nobody out there. <laughs> Alexis is there. Wait, it's been a long time since I just sat down and just filmed something. I mean, I film all the filming vlogs and stuff like that, but just to sit down and just eat or just film with makeup, I haven't done that in like probably a month and a half. Anyway, I'm super excited. You're right next to me. Hey y'all, seven, welcome. You're welcome back to my channel. Anyway, so I wanted to try the Burger King, um, you know, the original chicken sandwich. I love, that's the only thing, if I, I don't even really go out to fast food anymore, but if I do, it will be the Good Burger King, just for their original chicken sandwich with bacon. Yeah. Okay, so, I have my plate right here, some agua. And so, ooh, so first I have this. This is the chick, spicy chicken fries. They have the original. Now they have the spicy. I think I tried the original a long, long time ago, but never. I don't remember how it tastes. But they also have the spicy, and I want to try that. So this is the spicy. I thought there was so much more in there, but it doesn't matter. I'm not even gonna eat all of this. But yeah, that's their spicy chicken sandwich. I mean chicken. Fresh chicken fries, napkin, condiments, more condiments. Um, this one, I gotta go warm this up. This one is, this is the Italian Royal Crispy Chicken. It's the crispy white meat breast filet topped with marinara sauce and melty mozzarella cheese on a toasted potato bun. So, ooh, we're gonna go warm that up because it's cold. So that's the Italian one. And then the Mexican one. Let me see, where is that? Ooh, that one smells really, really good. This is the This is the Mexican, oh, what the heck is this? This is the Mexican original chicken sandwich. Features a long crispy fried breaded chicken patty served with spicy queso and crispy fried jalapenos. And it's also a long sesame seed bun. Ah, oh, my mom, don't eat that. So this is it right here. It looks, that's the jalapenos I'm guessing. Yeah. So we're gonna warm it up and then come back. Oh. Mama, you can't be on me like that. You see me do something. Anyway, so I got one of these. This is the Smirnoff Ice Pink Lemonade. I haven't had one in a long time. And since this is my cheat meal, I decided to add some little bit of liquor, alcohol into my little cheat day. Okay, let's dig in. But anyway, so let me get my ketchup. Mayo. Combination going on. Get everything ready. And then I don't have a spoon, so I'm just gonna do this. That big gonna be spicy. I don't know how spicy it's gonna be. That's why I got a little bit of water. Okay. Okay. And then my wall. I'll just watch the Sherlock Holmes, so I feel like I know whatever. But let's try these. 
how it looks like. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting for the spices to kick in. And there it is. That'll do it. Mm hmm I really like that. It's really good. I mean, I didn't expect it to be anything else. It's just like a chicken sandwich, but fries version. That's really, really good. Mm-hmm. A little spicy. And I ain't got no milk. It is spicy though. So let's try. Ah, uh, let's do the Mexican one. I feel like it's still a little cold though, right? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put it in the air fryer. Let's see. Back. If y'all hear that noise, that's the air fryer. Air frying. I really, really, really like this. It's not too spicy, but so it's really, really spicy now for me. Like my nose running, and I'm like, Ugh. yeah, that's spicy now. I didn't know that I ate like three or four. It's really, really spicy, and I don't like that. I'm like it's burning, and my nose is running. And I hate stuff like that. Like I don't mind a little kick, but I don't want to be sneezed in and snot running down. No, because I can't enjoy the food if my nose is running. But it's, it's it's good if you like spicy. But I'll probably stick to the original ones that are not spicy. So I give this a. Uh, Sorry, my camera just stopped. Has a thing where it just stops, but this. Mm, it's good. I love mozzarella, but. I feel like oh, I got something in my teeth. I feel like it don't go. Maybe because I'm just used to the original chicken sandwich, but this right here for me, I don't like the marinara on it. I don't like the marinara. Mm-mm. I don't think it goes with this. But if I had a choice between this and the original chicken sandwich, I would go with the original. But mm. Mm. yeah, I'm not rocking with it. The Italian one, I would give it a four. I just feel like the marinara does not go with the sandwich. Like, I mean, marinara is good with sandwiches, but I don't think it will be good. I don't know. I guess maybe I'm so used to marinara with like spaghetti and stuff, <laughs> but not to be anything like that. But I just don't feel like I, I just don't like it with. I don't like it with this sandwich don't do that yeah i don't like it with the chicken sandwich 
So let's try this one. This is the Mexican original chicken sandwich. Let me open it so we can get the jalapeno in there. Okay. Jalapeno. Mm hmm. I definitely taste the jalapeno, I definitely taste the queso. Get back. Lexi, don't go over there. Mmm. Mmm, try a little dip with it. Italian one with some dip too. So much bread. Ugh. Mm -mm. Yeah, no. Mm -mm. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like either of them. The Italian one was a four, the Mexican one, I'm going to say a three. I just I guess because I don't like, it's like I feel like it doesn't go. Just like this how you want, but I do not like jalapenos like that. Probably at all. I don't really care for jalapenos, so it's probably why my opinion is already biased because I don't like jalapenos. I like marinara, but not as much. Um, but I do like the mozzarella cheese, but yeah, these two are the no, four, three. No, this is a six, so that was pretty good. So let's get this out of the way and get on to the donuts. I really, really like that. I know this is not new. Um, definitely not new because I asked my sister about it. She said definitely not new. She always gets this one. If she doesn't get the rum raisin. And I like the rum raisin and the cherry one. But this, if you're not a pistachio person, I wouldn't recommend it because it's really heavy with pistachio pieces. But I really like it. And this one is the Halo Top Vanilla Bean. As y'all know, I'm on a health plan. So this is only 290 calories for this whole thing. Wow. This one per container is 900 calories. So you can see the difference. I just wanted to do... I love ice cream. And this one has sweat. It has a good source of protein. Mm -hmm. Ice cream is like my favorite, probably after chocolate cook after chocolate chip cookies. So I just wanna have like a healthier alternative because if my calorie intake is about eighteen hundred a day, 
if I eat the whole pint of this, because this is small. I can eat the whole thing. Let's just say that. Like, I'm not, I can't, I'm not going to just eat half. I'm going to eat the whole thing. But 900 calories, I'm not going to be able to eat anything else pretty much. I'm going to have, like, one more meal and that be it. Like, so, that's why I'm trying to try this to see if I'm going to like it so I don't buy these ones anymore and buy this. I'm still probably going to buy the rum raisin just in the blue, once in the blue moon because that's my favorite. But, let's try this one and see. Oh, it's frozen. So bad. Ooh. This is how it looks like. Just regular vanilla bean. Oh, that's cute. I'm cold. Let's spoon. <laughs> Bella, let's see trip. I mean, it's okay, I guess, because it doesn't have much sugar in it, so it's not the this one. I'll give it a the pistachio one, and yeah, the ten. That's good, but it's something that I cannot sit there and just eat the whole thing of, like the rum raisin. I can just like sit there and eat the whole thing, like no doubt. But this one, I feel like, cause I'm not huge on pistachio or peanuts type stuff, so I just can't sit there and eat the whole thing. I'll get tired and bored of it and annoyed with it. So that's why I give it eight out of ten. This one, six out of ten, just because it's not as sweet as I would want it, but it's still a healthier version. It's just not the best. But I'm probably going to get it again just because to, so I don't eat the bad ones. But okay, let's get into the best part. Da, 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 da. The St. Patrick's Day Donuts. Hmm. I love donuts. <laughs> But I'm not like a huge decorative donut person. Like my favorite is old fashioned and glazed. Like, and I like the 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 filled ones that have stuff inside. That's why this is the random one. This one is a lemon filled um, glazed donut right here. So I just wanted to try that one to see how it goes. But yeah, so excited. I feel like the ducky donuts I went to. I feel like they could do a little bit better. It's not, <clears throat> it wasn't giving, you know, my box could have been better, all that. Okay, so let's see what we got. So we have hat or gold donut, which is the one with the hat right here. And that one is a chocolate ice. Donut decorated with a plaid green icing pattern and top with a leprechaun hat sugar piece. So that's this one right here. So let's try that one and see. I don't. Probably should put this disclaimer, but I don't like chocolate donuts and I don't like sprinkled donuts. So, mm. uh uh. This is just giving me. I guess this one is just for decoration purposes because this is giving me a chocolate glazed donut. That's it. Mm hmm And this one. 
It is a chocolate ice with St. Patrick's sprinkles. St. Patrick's sprinkles donut. This regular donut with St. Patrick's Day sprinkles. It's the same thing as this one. Let me open this. But this is like the same thing as these sort of same thing, pretty much. Just decoration purposes. Then this one is golden sprinkled donut, an original glazed donut dipped in green icing. And top of a gold St. Patrick's Day sprinkle blend. You can see, hopefully, you can see the gold in it too. Ooh, I hate sprinkles so bad. See? I have another disclaimer. I don't care for much of Krispy Kreme. I'd rather go nothing on it. Um, just for the simple fact is that I feel like their stuff is way too sugary for me. So I don't go there. If I want like a donut, I'll go to Dunkin' Donuts. But I like their season stuff. So I usually that's why I, that's the only reason why I go because the season stuff. And I think it's really cute. That's why I be going, but I just feel like it's it's too sweet. Like this is too much for me. And I don't like it. Let's try this one. This is just the one I want to try. This is not part of the collection, but I just want to try it. Again. I'm pretty sure it's filled with um lemon. Hmm, let's give it a try. This was not too bad. Um, I just, the icing is just too thick. So this is too much. But if it was like less icing, I feel like it would be really, really good. And last but not least, that's what I was really, really excited for. It's the golden cookies and cream donut. This one. A golden cookie cream filled donut shell dipped in white icing and covered in golden cookie pieces and a gold sprinkle blender. Okay, so filled with something in there. Okay, all these donuts, I am a donut person, I just don't care for Krispy Kreme so much, but I think I will go with these two the best, slightly, but I'll probably give them like I'll give these four right here a two out of ten. Didn't like them, didn't care for them. And these probably a three out of ten. These two. They were better than smidge. 
better than those four. I did not, I didn't really care for that. So we're gonna just close the box because I'm done with that. And I, I didn't even eat the whole thing, I can't. It's not, I'm not rocking with it. Anyway, y'all, that's the end of the video. Anyway, that's the end of the video, y'all. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I have nothing in my face. Um, it was a little disappointing because I didn't really like the main stuff. So, but you know, it's all just to try, so it's okay. I, that's why I got them because I'm I'm not everything that I eat. I know I'm not gonna like everything. It's just to try it. But you won't see me getting the Burger King stuff anymore. This crispy stuff, it crispy cream stuff anymore. Well, this donuts. I mean, it's gonna be by the time this video goes up, hopefully on Friday, on St. Patrick's Day. So I won't bring this back. But and the thing is, it probably got. It got really cold because I got these in the morning um, and I had to drive an hour for them because there's no Krispy Kreme donuts where I stay so I had to drive for them so they probably got cold and stale and I don't know how long they've been sitting out previously so probably added to that I don't know but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did give it a big thumbs up also to this channel because I have a lot more things I'm gonna try and beauty things that I want to try as well anyway yeah and also hit that notification bell so you can be alerted every time I upload a video hopefully I jump back into the swing of things and upload a video once a week I can't do two times a week because I work my work schedule is all over the place so I can't even do that but I will try at least to get a video up once a week. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you in my next video. Bye. I feel like this purple lip was way too much for this video. But. <laughs> she just be staring at me. What you staring at, girl? What you staring at? She does just be staring at me when I'm doing stuff. You see? Chasing the tail and stuff. I spot her a new toy, she didn't tear it up. <laughs>